and we need more things to bring us together. That is tonight's CBS Evening News. We'll bring you the president's press conference when it starts right here on CBS. I'm Nora O'Donnell. We'll see you soon. Live from across mid-Missouri, this is KRCG 13, live at 6. Good evening. We are, of course, standing by for President Joe Biden's live news conference. At such time as that begins, we will cut away. Locally, Boone County commissioners have agreed unanimously to accept part of a $1.4 billion lawsuit settlement with several pharmaceutical companies dealing with the nation's opioid crisis. A presiding commissioner, Kip Kendrick, says the Kroger company has joined several other pharmaceutical suppliers in agreeing to the settlement to avoid lawsuits. The case alleges several large pharmaceutical companies stimulated the nation's opioid crisis through careless oversight on medication sales. The settlement gives Boone County at least $1.8 million through 2038. Kendrick projects next year's settlement payment to be about $300,000, and he plans to use the money to help prevent opioid overdoses. And humidity peak Sunday and Monday before there it is, folks. A cold front in the middle of the next work week comes in and helps bring those temperatures back down. Carve out a spot in the basement and just stay there for a couple of days. <laughs> That's cool. our report. We thank you for joining us. We will have more for you tonight at 10.